Hey there, welcome back. The wearable art fashion show is headed to Augusta in November. And here to share more is the artist, V. Marie. I love that. <laughs> Thank you for being here. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you so much for having me. No problem. Let's get right to it. So November 2nd, Summer House Realty on Washington Road. Yes. Okay, so what inspired you to create this event? Well, I've actually been doing these art shows for about four years now. Mm -hmm. uh, this is my second fashion show, but like I said, this is my fourth solo show. And I always just wanted to create something that was total art. I always wanted to have a show where all aspects of art was included, no matter the medium. So this is just the start of that. Yeah, so um, you have some pieces here. Yes. So will you be introducing any of these pieces at the show? Absolutely, so there are two parts of the runway show. The first show is actually art to fashion. So that's when, as you can see, I bring my paintings literally to life in the form of a garment. And then the second part of the show is called Colors, which mm -hmm. I think I yeah. <laughs> You're colorful right. today. <laughs> <laughs> I love the wig. Thank I really you do. so yeah. much. Thank so you. So what's the material? These are actually on? balloons. So uh, in the show, I'll be using non-traditional uh, yeah. materials. So I, uh, it took me about 20 hours, and I used over 350 balloons wow. to construct this. So uh, I consider myself a balloon artist, and it's one of my favorite mediums to use. OK. Yeah. So uh, let's talk about the designs that are going to be there and the performers. Mm -hmm. How do you select those folks? Well, I. I'm always on the hunt for different type of creatives in the CSRA area. I like to connect with many creatives here. So uh, just with other artists putting themselves out there, I select it uh, that way. So I will have a performance by Kiki Too Blunt. Uh, she will be performing her single Elevate. And another Augusta native, Larissa Young, she will be doing her spoken word through poetry and Opening the show will be United Ministry Interpretive Dance, their mime dancer. So literally, like, every aspect of art will be at this uh, event. Yeah, so Georgia Southern University, Georgia Southern. Eagles. Go Eagles. So <laughs> did, did you always want to do this when you were even at Georgia Southern? I knew I wanted to be an artist in the first grade. So wow. from then on, I, I just pursued and continued to um, harness my uh, craft. So, yes, I went to school for studio art and apparel design. And you said you're going to go back to school soon, I, too. Yes, I am going to go back for my master's. Yes, yes. Okay. So wearable art, how do you see that evolving in the fashion industry? Well, I am not the only person in the industry who has dabbled in wearable art. Um, there are many people ahead of me who have already, you know, showcased and shown their perspective of art to fashion. So this is just my take and my perspective on it. So I hope people enjoy my my take. Yeah. Okay, it looks good so far. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank so you. November the 2nd, if folks want to get tickets, how can they go about doing that? They can search me on Eventbrite at mm -hmm. V Marie, that's V-M-A-R-I-E, or you can find me on any social media platforms at V Marie Vart. So that's V-M-A-R-I-E, V-R-T. Okay, yes. so after this, what do you have planned? Just to continue to involve many artists in the CSRA, uh, I want this to be a staple in Augusta. Uh, I know many people ask me, do I plan on taking this show uh, out of town or like across states? Uh, eventually, yes, but I want people to know that there is great art here in Augusta and they don't have to travel hours to experience that. So folks like me, I'm just a regular person. <laughs> if I wanted to support local artists, how can I do that? Um, attending fashion shows, attending any type of local art show, uh, the arts in the heart, mm. just uh, sharing their uh, work. If you see it, you know, tell people about it, you know, um, and just by donating. Cool. Yeah. So if there's a young woman of color who's looking at you, but with your I'm pretty wig, <laughs> and they're thinking about doing the same thing, getting into fashion mm -hmm. and art, what would you tell her? Go to school. Uh, harness your craft, practice, practice, practice. It's okay to fail, there's gonna be trials and error, but just keep going. You, you must keep going, you must keep creating. Uh, so I tell that to all uh, younger artists to keep going. Like, I know it sounds so cliche, but you must, you honestly must. And Absolutely. trust yourself, trust yeah. yourself in your creative process. Okay, sounds good to me. Let me give you the date and time one more time. So it's going to be Saturday, November 2nd, yes. and that's going to be from 7 until 9.30. Doors will open at 6.30. Mm -hmm. That's going to be at Summer House Realty. That's at 2735 Washington Road here in Augusta. Correct. All yes. right. Anything else you'd like to add while I have you? Start where you're at. Work with what you got. Take things one day at a time and leave the results to God. There you go. Because people don't have the final say. God does. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. That's my message, y'all. Well, V. Marie, thank you for being here. Thank I appreciate you for having me. It. Don't let it be the last time. I always have a seat here for you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate you. <laughs> I appreciate you. And we'll be right back.